first of all visit thaswim.gov.in and then login with your credentials whether you want to login with your username or password or you can directly with your google account whatever the method you have chosen after logging in you will be landed to your dashboard click on my courses we will find all your courses on which you have uh, enrolled if you didn't find the course go to the course filter on the right side and then filter out the current courses you will find all the current courses and ultimately you will find the course for which you want to give your examination say for example i want to give my examination in one of the courses on photography and if it is uh, available for examination you will find an option to apply for exam on the right side menu so click on apply for exam you will be landed on a examination form you will find the date of examination and the fee so this is examination form where you can check all your details find out whether the all details are uh, correct or you can edit that detail for example in my case my date of birth is not given over here so my photo and signature is not also not up uploaded then just click now let me update my personal data and then click on the basic details like uh, fill out the date of birth your mobile number your aadhar card which is not mandatory what if you want fill you can fill and also your alternate number you can also fill your contact details and upload your photo and signature upload your photo and signature it's very simple just click on the choose file find out the file where you have kept your photo you should go to the specification of the photos that it should be between 20 to 150 kb and then upload your signature that should be 20 to 150 kb and only jpg or jpeg files uh, should be there so upload your signature and then choose your category the which category you belong and then if you belong to any category then you have to upload your certificate also so keep the certificate in pdf format and then come to your educational institution say for example if you are registered in any of the university if you say yes then you go to find out which university or which institutions you have uh, enrolled or you have registered if you want the credit transfer and if you just want the certificate then keep it no and then update so this is uh, the basic details now choose uh, the course name exam date is also given choose the primary exam location like your exam state ct and slot two slots are available and then the secondary exam location that should be different from the first one it should be different and then choose the city again and then the slot and then uh, verify that uh, the information you have uploaded are correct click on the yes and then click on yes to proceed for uh, payment so pay online using the credit card and debit card so click on pay online so there are uh, many ways to 
pay online first you need to fill your billing information if it is not filled already and if your uh, billing address is different then click on the option then we have the payment information you can pay it by using the credit card debit card net banking cash card mobile payments paytm wallet upi so there are many ways to pay online so for example i am paying with my paytm account you can just uh, it will charge the 21 rupees uh, in all the payment gateways as a transaction fee so when you paid uh, the fee you will get an intimation by the swim like this one and you will get the email with the invoice detail so thank you very much